Hi, everyone. Congressman Lloyd Smucker here. Fall is almost here, believe it or not, now that August is over. Uh, and each month I bring to you uh, a monthly rewind with uh, legislative news, with my uh, travels across the district and any other important updates. Uh, so I hope you'll tune in every month and I hope you share this video with your friends and your neighbors. August was a busy month back in the district. I uh, very much appreciated the opportunity to meet with and visit with people all across uh, Pennsylvania's 11th Congressional District, which I'm fortunate to be able to represent. Uh, I appreciate the opportunity to visit businesses along Main Street in Denver Borough in northern Lancaster County uh, with Mayor Rod Redkay. Congratulations to the Elizabethtown Fair as they celebrate their 50th anniversary this year. It was an honor to join the opening ceremonies and chat with Mayor Chuck Mommer. It was also a great honor to visit with uh, veterans who live in Lancaster at the Hamilton Arms Center to honor them for their service. I also want to thank Navy veteran David Strouser of York for his service to our nation. My office was able to assist David in receiving his National Defense Service Medal, which he earned while serving our nation during the Vietnam War. Thank you so much for your service to our nation, David. I also enjoyed visiting an Amish farm in Lancaster County to learn more about the great conservation efforts on that farm and on farms across our community in partnership with the Alliance for the Chesapeake Bay. I appreciated our discussion about how federal policies can further support our farmers and can improve our environment. It was also great to tour Perrydale Farms in York along with the York County Economic Alliance to learn about their farm's history and their milk bottling operation. And thanks to local leaders from York Township, uh, Dallas Town Borough, Yo Borough, and the Dallas Town School District for meeting with me to provide an update on what's happening uh, in our community and also hear what's going on in Washington. And then I appreciated joining the Hershey Company, uh, the Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, uh, and state partners at Central Manor Dairy to announce a $2 million public-private investment to support local dairy farmers' conservation efforts. As stewards of the land, our farmers here want clean water. They want sustainable agriculture for future generations. So it was really great to see all of these organizations work together cooperatively to provide additional assistance for local farmers. And then I'd like to say congratulations to the Hanover Chamber of Commerce on their 100th anniversary. Thank you for a century of advocating for and strengthening the local business community. I appreciated visiting WGAL News 8 Studios for a behind the scenes tour with station president and general manager, Sydney DeLuca, and to sit down for an in-depth interview with WGAL's Barbara Barr on the many issues facing our nation. I also joined Penn State Health's uh, Rec Fest 2023, which was held at Spooky Nook, a sports complex here. Uh, and it was a wonderful event. This was a program that offered demonstrations of adaptive sports and provided additional information for individuals of all ages and abilities uh, to help them be able to participate in sports. Uh, and I had a great opportunity to play with members of the Central Pennsylvania Phenom wheelchair rugby team, which was a lot of fun. Uh, but again, a wonderful event. And I want to thank Penn State Health uh, and also Select Medical uh, for sponsoring this. And then for all the volunteers who worked very, very hard to put together this really great community event. So it was a really great time meeting with so many folks from across the district to hear your stories, to learn what issues are important to you, and to hear what you'd like to see accomplished in Washington. And as always, I really, really need and I appreciate all of the feedback. In fact, if you'd like to meet with me to discuss an issue that you're passionate about, or if there's a community organization or a small business that you think I should visit, please reach out to my office. You can do so by giving us a call or by visiting my website at smucker.house.gov. Again, smucker.house.gov. Also, as we wrap up this August in review, I want you to know that my office is always here to help you. So if you're experiencing an issue with a federal department or an agency, 
uh, like uh, Social Security Administration, IRS, Veterans Affairs, whatever it may be. If we can be helpful in any way, please contact my office for assistance. Again, the website smucker.house.gov. Thank you.